So today we are going to show you how you can show Google Maps in your site without providing an API key. API key limits the requests per day, if you do not provide your billing address. You can send one request per day, but in this video we will show you a way to send as many requests as you want. So we have created a file named Google Maps.php. First we are going to create a form with the method post. Create an input field with type text. Name should be address. And placeholder can be anything you want to display, as a hint. Now create a submit button. We are giving it a name, so we can access it in PHP, submit address. Create a PHP block and write a condition to check, if this submit button is clicked. Now we are going to get the value of this address field. Address is equal to, dollar underscore post. Address and then split the PHP tag to show a map. Create an a frame tag. Give it width to 100%. Height to 500 pixels. And source will be the value that will send a request to Google Map. HTTPS colon double slash maps.google.com slash maps question mark means the parameter q is equal to and here we will place our address which we are getting in above variable make sure to have output is equal to embed it will render the map just save it and refresh the page write any address here and hit enter And here it has displays the map with our address. Let's try another address for confirmation. So it is working fine. Now we are going to show you a method, for how you can show a map if you are receiving latitude and longitude. In most of the cases, you will be receiving latitude and longitude of user's location and you have to draw that on a map. So we are going to create another simple form with two fields, latitude and longitude. Latitude. Longitude and a submit button. Give it a name different than the other form. Now, right below this address block, create a new block to check when the coordinate form is submitted. Get latitude and longitude values from input fields. And now again we have to split the PHP tag. Create an a frame tag. Give it width and height of your choice. and the value of source attribute will be almost similar to the previous one. In Q parameter, first you have to give the value of latitude. Separate with a comma. And then the value of longitude.
right output is equal to embed to render the map. Save and refresh the page. We are going to get the latitude and longitude from this website for testing. But you can place your values if you are getting from database. Copy latitude and paste here. And same goes for longitude. Submit the form. And here is the map rendered using latitude and longitude. The map rendered via coordinates is automatically optimized by Google. But you can also optimize the map which we are rendering via address. Since we might have spaces in address, so you can replace the space by plus sign. And it will optimize the map. String replaces the built in PHP function. Replace space by plus sign in address variable, and we are assigning it back to address variable. So it will update the value of address variable. Now, if you write any address, it will show the location more accurately than it was displaying before. So that's how you can show Google Maps in your website using simple address, or by using latitude and longitude, without having to provide an API key. Test for Oxford University, and it will display the map more accurately. So that's all for now. If you face any problem, feel free to ask in the comments section below.